What's up guys, Leopold the Brave here, and I'm gonna bring you 5 features I'd like to see in Tekken 7. I know Op Williams literally just made a video like this, and it'll probably be pretty similar to his video, but I have been planning this video for a while now, I just haven't made it yet for some reason. The first feature I'd like to see is a cool replay editor. In the reveal trailers, we see the HUD hidden, the camera at different angles, and even the footage speed up and slow down. I kinda figured that since Tekken 7 is trying to give off more of a cinematic feel, then we should have the ability to make our own cinematics. This is probably asking for a bit much, but I'd like to see a replay editor as detailed as Team Fortress 2's, where you have a free moving camera that you can record while it's moving, speed up, slow down, and even stop the footage entirely for cool freeze frames. Then we could create our own scenes like the one at the end of Akuma's reveal trailer where he's shooting a Go Hadouken at Kazuya and Kazuya's about to punch it. I figured that'd be a cool, neat little feature. The second feature I'd like to see is the return of Tekken Force mode. Tekken Force has appeared in every Tekken game in some form or fashion after Tekken 3. Tekken 4 had it, Tekken 5 had Devil Within, and Tekken 6 had the Scenario Campaign. While it is very likely that Tekken Force mode will return, I'm not quite sure what kind of style they'll use. Some people like Tekken 3's style, some people like Tekken 4. I personally prefer the Scenario Campaign style, where it's multiplayer, you can pick up weapons the enemies drop, and some of the levels even intersect with the stages in the game. I always thought that was pretty cool, and it'd be neat to see it make a return. The third feature I'd like to see is crossplay. Tekken 7 is coming on the PS4, Xbox One, and PC, so the community will be pretty divided between consoles. So I figured it'd be a neat little feature if we could crossplay. Now, Harada did mention how this could be a problem. The users on PC could be hackers and use their mods to cheat in the game online. My solution to that is to just make crossplay a separate online mode from regular play, and then just give a little warning to users who select crossplay that they'd be at risk of facing a cheater. It's not like you come across a cheater very much, anyways. There's probably only a small handful of people that actually have a computer that can run Tekken 7, and it's likely that an even smaller handful of those people actually have the capabilities to mod in the first place. The fourth feature I want to see is deeper customization. Now this is something that everyone wants to see. While Tekken 6 and Tekken Tag 2's customization was detailed, they were both missing something. Tekken 6 was missing Tekken Tag 2's color editor, so you'd need to buy the same item multiple times if you wanted it in a different color. Tekken Tag 2 was missing the variety and things you could customize, like shoes. Luckily, Tekken 7 already seems more detailed, with face paint added, the ability to change default hair color, and skin tones. They're also going to have crossover costumes from Street Fighter, which is super cool, and I hope to see crossover costumes of other name co-properties like Soul Calibur. So overall, I can't wait to see the finished product of Tekken 7's customization mode, and I hope it's more detailed than the previous two games. The final feature I'd like to see is another fun mode. Tekken Ball and Tekken Bull mode are very popular, and fans have requested Harada to bring it back. And while Tekken Ball did come back, it was only in the Wii U version of Tekken Tag Tournament 2, leaving out the PS3 and Xbox players. And they did bring back Tekken Bull on iOS as a fun little app to play, but there's only three characters, and... It's not quite as fun as on consoles. So I'd like to see either of those two modes return, or maybe even a brand new fun mode. I even joked with a friend earlier about, what if Tekken Chess? That'd be pretty fun. Give it online mode too. Or maybe I'm just biased because I really like chess and I'm super good at it. Either way, fun mode. Make it happen, Harada. And those are the five features I want to see in Tekken 7.